Hi, my name is Arnaud Debier, and I coordinate a project in Brazil called Anteaters and Highways, which is supported by the uh, Greenville Zoo. And so here at the entrance of the zoo, you have this wonderful kiosk and course for conservation where um, you can vote on different projects and, and make a contribution to the, to the projects, the field projects, and this goes directly to, to us. What are we doing with the funds from the Greenville Zoo? We are purchasing um, collars that we place, which are actually harnesses that we place on the animals. And this enables us to understand how, when, where and why giant anteaters are crossing highways. Because a huge impact to the, these animals where we, where we work is that they get hit by cars. They're actually the third most um, killed animal on our roads. And, and, and this species, they have a young, maybe one pup every one or two years. So, so the numbers are staggering. Um, for example, we've been monitoring our, high, our highways in our area. And in the last 11 months, we lost, we, we found 218 carcasses of giant anteaters. So these are huge numbers. So you can see that these highways are almost acting as population sinks. So imagine a sink with a drain. That's kind of what these highways are doing. They're draining animals away so they can probably cause local extinctions. So what we're trying to do is we're doing road surveys to understand if there are any hot spots. We're also putting the collars on these animals to try to understand where it is exactly that they cross, what motivates the crossing. So what time are they crossing? Are there certain landscape features that encourage them to cross? Are they spending a lot of time at the edge of the highways? Or what, it, what is it? So we're trying to conduct this study to find, uh, to be able to mitigate this threat, to find solutions to decrease the deaths of giant anteaters. Every, every, every Sun Council, thank you so much to everybody who visits the Greenville Zoo. Thank you for participating in these different programs. This is one of several um, conservation programs that the zoo participates in. And, and um, just so everybody knows that this, this, these funds go directly to field conservationists and we're really grateful. And so by visiting the zoo, you're actually saving animals. So thank you so much.